Hello ladies and gentlemen and welcome to the Rosara Network. I'm Rich Walker and with me today is Dan Webb. Hi Rich, uh, you missed a trick there. Why did I? Well, you, should, you, could have, you should have said, welcome to Jurassic Park. Ah oh, man. But you didn't. Oh so. let's start again, I'm only joking. No. Um, yeah, so this is Jurassic World Evolution is what we're looking at today. And it looks like Rich, like they spared no expense. We spared no expense Dan. <laughs> uh, Jurassic, Park, <laughs> Jurassic Park fans will get that, it's hilarious. <laughs> Uh, so yeah, this is the beginning of the game, right? In case you're wondering, there are five islands, the uh, five deaths they're known as, which is uh, heartening. Deaths. Yeah, the five deaths. Jesus. The uh, cinco muertas. Uh, so yeah, heartening. Uh, you start with this basic theme park, and Cabot Finch is your kind of guide at the beginning. He takes you through the basics. You got your park entrance over there with the little monorail that brings guests in. Can You've they fly in on helicopter as well? Uh, I don't know if they can. I think they fly oh, really? to the island via helicopter oh, and they okay. take, catch oh, okay, the monorail okay, in. Yeah, okay, that makes sense. Um, you've got your. I'm going to take you through the buildings basically. So the first thing you do is you build a paddock for creating your dinosaurs, for is, genetically engineering is this them. It? This is it. Yeah, the Hammond Creation Lab. So to begin with, you've got very, very few resources to work with. So you're literally only able to make the Struthiomimus to begin with. And you got Dr. Ian Malcolm as well, Jeff Goldblum, mate. You know, um, he's I'm, in it. I'm just looking forward to seeing 15 minutes of you pronounce dinosaur names that you might not be able to pronounce. Oh, I was well into dinosaur, dinosaurs when I was younger, so okay. uh, I think I'll be right. Struthiomimus. Yeah. I would not yeah. have got that. Right. that? Oh, yeah, I would have gone I think Struthiomimus. You would have. I think yeah, 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 for sure. So, yeah, life uh, finds a way, and what you do is you incubate your eggs. Which you get from uh, fossils and I like that, by the way. you know samples. Thanks. Just thanks. The, the, Life the uh, finds a way. Yeah, just thanks. Quite, mate. <laughs> Hold on to your butts. So oh no, yeah, let's just <laughs> see how many quotes <laughs> yeah, you can get. That's it. So there we go. Clever girl, right? Yeah. Ah, uh, there we go. <laughs> <laughs> this is the first time I saw you create, basically. Do they move in herds? Some of these do <laughs> move in herds. Yes. <laughs> They do. So, are you just following this dinosaur now? Yeah, you can follow it around, you can check what it's doing, you can look at its statistics if you like. Uh, they have how do requirements. They, how do, they feed? do you have to feed them? Or? Yeah, you do have to. You learn that later on, I didn't realise that at this point. There's these three factions as well you work for within the park. So, you've got a science contract, obviously, they want to pursue the dinosaur genetics for scientific purposes, the entertainment who want to flog it and make money. And then you've got the uh, kind of security division who want to kind of militarise dinosaurs. What? Really? You know what I mean? what turn yeah. them into weapons? Yeah. Really? I mean, you, you have that's to kind of... That's the stupidest idea I've heard. Well, you know, that's why they've been... like. Uh, there's two reasons they splice dinosaurs in the new movies. One to create more of a uh, like attraction, something new and crazy, as if as if dinosaurs, you know, it wasn't enough, um, and then you know for uh, military purposes, right? So this is expeditions. This is your bread and butter that you've just sort of missed. You can go around the maps and dig up fossils with your research team, and they bring them back, and then you can f uh, create new dinosaurs based okay. on the samples they bring back. So that's the next thing you build is that ex expedition center. Uh, I'm running low on power here, so I create a new uh, power station, so I've got substations as well, so I can distribute more power to the park. I um, also built a ranger station you saw a second ago, so I've got park staff who can cure dinosaurs if they're ill, they can go out and uh, deal with any escaped dinosaurs, basically you're kind of caretakers. Um, so what you won't have seen is during that expedition I sent out for, they brought back Triceratops material. So I was able to create my own Triceratops now. So there you go. Welcome my uh, Triceratops to the park. What are we going to call How them, awesome Rich? is that? Uh, you can rename them, but I just left the names as like TRC-001 and stuff like that. But you can call them whatever you want. That's uh, pretty cool. Tricky Dicky. <laughs> tricky tri -C, Tricky Tri... Yeah. So anyway, we've got weather to deal with as well, so it's chucking it down. Uh, there you go, there's another little expedition going out for more fossils and so uh, genetic material. So this is material. around the entire island, can you, you occupy the entire island? Uh, most of it, most of what you can see here you can build upon. Um, obviously flat, viable areas. Uh, this is just me checking in on my dinosaurs. You see I've put down food now, so those bushes, they, they come up. They okay. need uh, replenishing by your rangers as well, so you have to keep those uh, kind of topped up. Can the dinosaurs eat the rangers? No, no, no. Uh, well, I guess so. Yeah, I guess the carnivores can, but you've only got herbivores at this time. Um, but yeah, if they get free, they so can run wild. Uh, oh, wait, so hold on. So the, the expeditions are going around the US? Uh, no, the whole world. 
Oh, okay. The expeditions can go anywhere. But this is um, they're not expeditions on the island. They're no, 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 no. Oh, oh, okay, oh anywhere okay, in the world. Okay. okay. Yeah. Uh, this is that was just um, upgrades for your island that you can buy. So you can buy like the ability to build a gift shop and make more money and stuff like that, uh, or little buffs and things. Um, that's your fossil center. That's where all your fossils get sent to. Obviously, you can sell them for more money, or you can add them to the genome. So there are certain dinosaurs you can't make until you've got a viable enough genome like an edmontosaurus like an edmontosaurus exactly this is a whole other thing as well so any dinosaur you create you can mess with their genetic code Jesus so you can change Christ. their colors you can give them like thicker skin better survivability stuff like that so the devs told me that you could create like a herbivore that could kick a t-rex's ass because you've sort of made its genetic code oh, right. better have you just done so that? i've yeah i've created this new struthia minus with a different color like pattern a gecko. And, yeah exactly so you can get all these different patterns by doing research and stuff. And you've got little goals you can do for each faction. Like I've got three on the go here. So the entertainment want me to up my park to a half star rating. My profit per minute needs boosting. Um, this is proper. The kind science, of deep, isn't it? science division want me to build, connect and power a gift shop. Can, and can, security can they want escape me to find a carnivore. When you open that gate? No, they can't. No, that okay. would be harsh, wouldn't it? That'd yeah, be too imagine unfair. that. Yeah. Oh, so, Jesus Christ. <laughs> so, yeah, you can drive this around and uh, go anywhere you like. Later on, you can get like a chopper as well and have your ranger team flying oh, around shit. in a helicopter. Which so will actually. Ranger team. So, this is, these are the guys that yeah. replenish the food and yeah, stuff. Yeah, exactly. They're all I've got so far. In the next video, though, you'll see the rangers in the helicopters and stuff. We'll show you that in the, the next video we do. Uh, so, here's the gift shop. This is going to boost my profits considerably. I'm just finding the best place. I feel like you haven't thought this through. Well, I thought as the guests come in, they can no, visit but the gift shop general, straight away. Right? I, would, I would have had like, the entertainment part as you come off the thing. And then yeah. I would have had like, the business side well, the where you do is, all the genetics and stuff this like, is away from everywhere well, else. No, no, this is already in place. You don't really get much of a say in where all this stuff can you is. you not move it? No, well, maybe, yeah. But it's money and I was do really struggling. Work, man? I was struggling for cash here. Yeah, it's awesome, isn't it? <laughs> yeah, I was really, really struggling. Basically, I put too much money into research and uh, like fossils and stuff so this is where you can make a bit of money as well you can take photographs uh, so i did make an edmontosaurus there you oh, go yeah. see look. but look at that you know 10 grand from one photo oh jesus you got two two and a half grand for the triceratops there. exactly yeah so even the though you did spend a lot of money researching it yeah you actually made some money back so the more exotic and rare the dinosaur the more money you make from so pictures you can just keep taking photos no i tried taking a photo again it's like less and less and less oh is it yeah 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 so it's got to be not new dinosaurs that. and stuff like that. And new yeah, 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 and new, new stuff. Kind of like Dead Rising, I suppose, right? Like if you're Frank West, you got to yeah, like keep yeah, mixing yeah. up the photos. So this is me building a new area of the park now because I'm going to bring a carnivore in. So I was, I've created a separate area for the carnivores. You could release a carnivore into the herbivore area if you're a psycho I've and seen, you wanted to I've fuck up your park. I've seen what you did when you let the T-Rex. Well, you'll see that in the next video. There's a teaser. The next um, video is that the next one? The next so we're one doing we did. three, right? We're going to do three videos. Yeah, um, you got to connect everything with paths and power, obviously. Course, Otherwise, yeah. you know, they that, won't work. Uh, this this is kind of winding me up, though. Well, that's that way that bends. I couldn't do anything about that. Are I know you sure? you're. I know you're you sure? Because that, oh, that annoys me. I had time restrictions as well. I'm yeah, sure true. I oh, yeah, because it, it's know. only a preview. Exactly. It's not like if that was me, I'd I'd make it work. Yeah. Yeah. Well, when the full game comes out, I'd, I'd probably do the same. Um, so that was me building an extra power station to uh, generate this electric fence I'm going to have. Obviously, it's going to be quite power intensive, but you need to have electric fences in place for the carnivores because if they get out, they'll, you know, wreak havoc. Exactly. Uh, so you can free build these, obviously, like this. Um, I'm taking my time here, making sure he's got a nice little area. But you'll notice that he hasn't got like a water source or anything or any food. So I'll create that. Um, so you can then, create a water source. Yeah, you can completely like terraform your park. Oh, okay. You can uh, so like if it's a big mountain. You can just flatten the mountain. I don't know whether you can change existing environments. Maybe you can. Yeah, you probably can actually, because you can create like mounds, uh, hills, and things. So I'm, I'm guessing you could probably flatten them too. Can you get like um, pterodactyls and stuff like that? Mm. How would that work? Uh, they did have you, them in Jurassic, Jurassic World, don't they? Yeah, yeah. they had like. Um, Cages like like a bird's oh, sort of yeah, cage, yeah, didn't yeah, they? Yeah, yeah. Um, so Imagine maybe they get out. <laughs> yeah, right. I know. Just fly over to mainland well, America. They, they do in Jurassic World, uh, Park three and Jurassic Is that World, the one don't they? In the, in the city. Uh, oh yeah, yeah, yeah. No, in, in Jurassic World, don't they swoop and pick up the guests? And oh, I can't remember. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I think it they is do. so forgettable. <laughs> wow, harsh. Yeah, well, it's not. It's not it, a great it, film. It, it's not bad, but it's just not. Yeah. 
It's not the original, right? No, exactly. Exactly. What is? What is? Apart from the original. Yeah. Um, that's going to annoy you as well. Just that sort is, of undulated this bit. Is, this is all <laughs> winding me up. This is triggering I'm me. I'm sorry. So, yeah, there we go. Um, the Ceratosaurus is incubating now. So, he's my, my carnivore fella. Rich, what's your favourite dinosaur? Uh, a Ceratosaurus. <laughs> no, it's a... It's a uh, hmm, I'm quite fond of an Iguanodon. Okay. But, you know... Are they you, just like big iguanas? Iguanodons have the pointy thumbs, spiky... Spiky thumbs. Um, I have no idea, mate. Uh, T-Rex. You know, you can't go wrong with that. Can't go wrong with a T-Rex. So you go and build him in a little lake so you can have some water, you can drink. It's looking a bit sparse, though, so, you know, a bit of landscaping. Going to add some treeage. So did you see, like, the drop and yeah, raising of the yeah. terrain? So, you know, just make it a little bit more exotic. That's nice, right? Right, and he'll be a bit happier because each dinosaur has needs as well, like a comfort need, food, obviously, water and all that. Do you got to keep your dinosaurs happy unless you want them to go on a rampage? Mate, you've gone to Portugal and you found yourself a Ceratosaurus. I'm trying to get more viable, um, what's it's got, emergency shelter as well if anything goes wrong, like oh, storms okay. and weather and stuff, or dinosaurs breaking free. These are all considerations, you know, you've got to take into account. So is it, is it, is it like a story mode? Kind of, like well this kind of is. is you have different goals one and One island, stuff. Like five. Five islands. Five oh, yeah, islands, yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, but like... It, do they each have different objectives? What, I think, yeah, the, I think it gets it more and more difficult. It's it gets like a sandbox. I think the object objectives get tougher, and it's about balancing like who you keep happy of the science, security, and well, you're uh, keeping bloody no one happy, aren't you? Well, I mean, the security guys aren't happy at the moment because my park's too low a rating, and the science people want a small or medium herbivore fossil, which I'm why I'm sending out more expeditions. But look, my Ceratosaurus is ready. So uh, here he comes. Oh shit! It looks like um, the Monster Hunter World. The um oh the um yeah, he does look a bit like that. I know what you mean. I can't remember its name now. Jeez, that's gonna that's gonna wind the me up. The pink the pink dinosaur thingy. The, the uh, ng uh, anginath anginath anginath. So we got yeah, there. We got, we got there. there. So yeah, there that's you go. That's cool. That's cool. It's good, isn't it? Do you know how many kind of dinosaurs there are? Oh man, I I had um a demo that they loaded for me later, and there were dozens. Like literally, just dozens, pages of them. Yeah, oh, do- uh, dozens. Like, I'd like say twelve. No, no like twenty-four th- th- at least. Like th- I'd say forty, fifty odd at least. Okay, I can't, based I on what name I saw, forty or fifty. Uh, I'd struggle, but no, yeah, there's a lot. You've got one minute left. Stegosaurus, Diplodocus, Brachiosaurus, uh, Apatosaurus, uh, Carnotaurus. I don't know loads. Ceratosaurus, Ceratosaurus, T-Rex, Pterodactyl, uh, Iguanodon, uh, uh, Triceratops. What's the, the Deinonychus, did he, did Velociraptor, what's the, Diplodocus. Uh, did you say Diplodocus? Uh, oh, wasn't there another one? Uh, Dilophosaurus. Dilophosaurus. That's what yeah, I was looking for. Yeah, loads. Anyway, we could do this all day. Is that Raptor? <laughs> well, we've still, we've still got another fifty yeah, seconds. Velociraptor. Yeah, I do like yeah, a good yeah. Raptor. See, so, yeah, we put down some lovely meat. Why is that obstructed? So you can put down live, uh, like a goat. Oh wow! You know, like in Jurassic Park for the the uh, carnivores. Is that but what I just that is? I just gave him some meat chunks. I don't know. Goat feels kind of harsh. Maybe I'll do that uh, another time. Well, just so yeah, there's a carnivore just, feeder. Can't, can't you just feed it like the uh, the tourists? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> just have can. a little path just, that goes in. Just break a piece of the fence off. Yeah. <laughs> You won't make much money and your park will fall apart, but it's fine. Did you so enjoy you it? I did enjoy it very much, very much. And that's out on the 12th of June for Xbox One, PlayStation 4 and PC. So that was Jurassic World Evolution. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to comment, like and subscribe. See you next time. Bye. <laughs>